So, Jero, explain explain yourself to the listeners who yep. only know you from the last two minutes. <laughs> uh, who am I? I'm a uh, I'm a guy. I do comedy. I'm a comedy guy. Okay, I, well, that doesn't help. No, not at all. I I'm a optimistic, uh, enthusiastic clown. That's what I am. What clown isn't optimistic and enthusiastic? Although sometimes I'm cynical. Okay. But I'm optimistically cynical. What Do is, the, is what's the tension between those two? You're both the what at opposite ends? Because you're optimistic, but at the same time. I don't know, like I find I often complain about stuff, but I'm like, ah, it doesn't actually bother me and it'll be fine in the end and we've got nothing to worry about. But here's some grievances, some mild grievances I have. And, you know, I'm jaded about X, Y, Z, but at the same time I'm really grateful and happy to, you know, have whatever, you know. It's this weird duality of life for us. That, that's who I am. I'm a into the duality of so, life. So, are you a Gemini clown? No, I'm a Cancer. You're a Cancer clown? Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> and I like a good pun. Um, but, yeah, I, I, I do improv comedy. I do sketch, clowning, a bit of acting where I can. And, yeah, I like to perform. I like to teach. And I like just to muck around and be silly. All right. You're a teacher, huh? Yeah. Bre- bre- break through to me. Break through to you. Break through to me. I'm an inner city kid. You're an inner city kid and you need you need some guidance. I need some guidance in my life. What would you tell me? What I'd tell you, Ross, is that, you know, life isn't about uh, going out of your comfort zone. It's about extending that comfort zone. It's about taking all the opportunities that are afforded to you, finding them and, and uh, breaking through them and, and finding ways to to enjoy them. Uh, to the best of your ability, I think 